Good morning, everybody. I have to hide back behind the massage chairs because I did not get in here to film quickly enough so the sun is really bright and it makes my face look like Edward from Twilight. And the only reason I'm making that reference is because I just watched the majority of those movies like last week. Today is a fasting day and I'm gonna make it through the day. I have made it through the past two days. I did have a hot chocolate, so I might have to resort to that again, but I'm gonna make it through the day. I'm feeling really good today, really confident. Um, it's gonna be a good one. By the way, if you hear a weird noise, somebody left on the um, ocean sounds by the massage chairs. Maybe it's rain. It's terrible, it's just terrible. I will check back in with you guys later. I'll probably be at home since not a lot's gonna happen today. You guys know how interesting my life is. On that note, what are some things you guys wanna see in my vlogs? Um, besides recipes and stuff, I wanna make them more appealing and interesting to you. If you guys have any questions, if you guys wanna see more about what I do during the day, like grocery shopping and things like that, let me know so I can record and show you guys a little bit more of what I do. I really enjoy vlogging. I think it's a lot of fun. In a year, I'll look back at all my vlogs and see how much I've changed and that's exciting to me. So anyways, if you guys have any suggestions, any thoughts, let me know and I will record them for you guys. I've been watching a couple other vlog channels to get some inspiration on how to film things and I like the ideas. It definitely takes a lot of dedication, but I do need to come up with some different transitions instead of saying, hey guys, every time I turn on my camera because obviously it's all in the same day unless I'm filming a new day or whatever, but yeah. Long story short, give me some ideas. I wanna know what you guys wanna see and then I can film something more interesting than just this. I will see you guys whenever I get home. So much for confidence at not eating today. My manager made dip and brought in chips for one of my coworkers whose birthday was today and that's what she wanted. So one of my other coworkers was like, you should go get some, you know, get it for tomorrow. And of course I knew, I was like, if I go and get some of that, I'm, I'm gonna eat it now. I'm not gonna leave dip on plate. And I, how would I save that, you know? Anyway, so I had three tablespoons. One was dill dip, one was like a French onion dip, and the other was a spicier dip. I'm not really sure what it was, with some Ruffles potato chips, some of these different kinds of crackers. I didn't really care for them. And some of the like rye pumpernickel bread or whatever that went with the dill dip. So it was like 470 calories altogether, I think, and that's just a rough estimate, of course. And of course, after I did it, I was like, why? Am I terrible at this? <laughs> so on break, I kind of walked back and forth on my floor. I made actually, I walked like a thousand steps. And according to um, a website I looked at that kind of helps with like obesity and people and stuff, 20 steps is one calorie lost. So I lost like 50 calories. So 420 calories, kind of. I don't know, I'm under my 500, and I'm such a hypocrite when it comes to telling people, hey, you know, you're under your 500, it doesn't matter, it doesn't count, but for me, somebody who's been doing this for so long, whenever I do break and eat, I just feel like bad about it. So that's kind of where I am today. I wanted to make it through January without really eating on my fasting days, and I failed so far. So maybe February is the month for me. We will see, I'm not sure. Anyways, that is the update for now. I don't know what I'm gonna do tonight. I really need to come up with something so that I am occupied and not thinking about eating more. I'm gonna fill up my water bottle, chug it, and go from there. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Well, Into the Woods was good-ish. I hadn't really seen it since it came out. So it's been a while and I hadn't remembered most of the story, honestly, and I could definitely tell that it was a stage play just by the movie, you know, um, how ridiculous it is and stuff like that. But that's what I did tonight. That's a long ass movie. So it is about 8.20. I've already taken my shower. I think I'm gonna go lay down in bed because that's how interesting my Thursday nights are, as you guys already know. I have packed my lunch for tomorrow. I am ready for Friday. I'm so ready for this week to be over just for a two day weekend. I'm gonna go play on my phone for a little bit on Pinterest or something and see if I can find some more recipes. That is the way my evening is gonna go. TGI freaking F. This week has taken so long and I think it's because we had off Monday. I'm so ready for this weekend so I can sleep in tomorrow or as long as battles roll up me which will probably only be eight o'clock like always but 
I'm excited. Today is an eat day. So I brought the rest of my breakfast cookies. I brought the rest of my peanut butter dip. I probably won't eat all of that though because since there's still quite a bit left. And then for lunch, I brought the leftover Philly cheese turkey joe. And I'm going to make that. And I don't know what I'm going to do for dinner yet. I'll either eat the rest of that um, Philly cheese turkey joe and my chili or I will come up with something else. I don't really know what I have planned yet. Um, not really planning on doing anything tonight. I'm pretty sure I'll be home alone so I might just watch a movie. I might... I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Good news is the snow has finally melted. Um, quite a bit actually. There's not a lot left so it's kind of starting to feel like it's going to turn around and get out of this crappy winter that we've been having um, which is great because that means I can get out and do more stuff and Bowser won't be so bored anymore being stuck inside because it's too cold to walk him and he takes forever. Anyway that is the only update I have right now. Um, of course work. Work until I'm done. Go home. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Something's gonna happen. Don't know what yet. Probably nothing. I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, I am home after the long day. That wasn't really that bad though. It wasn't like the other ones, which is great. I'm sitting on my floor right now because I just put a hard drive into Ian's Xbox to see if I can play the game The Herbs that I got from Vintage Stock the other day, but it wouldn't work because I didn't have an official Xbox hard drive. So now I do. I really hope this game works because it's a game of my childhood and it's the best Sims game out there, I think. For lunch, I ended up having those open-faced turkey sloppy joes and they were pretty good. Um, but then I also ended up getting some sour cream and onion K chips from like the vending machine, there were 100 calories um, in the baggie, so I had that as well, which leaves me with about 661 calories left for the rest of the day to kind of eat uh, dinner. So I haven't really decided what I'm gonna do yet. Like I said, I have a little bit of chili left. I really don't wanna waste it. And I also have a little bit of the Philly cheese sloppy Joseph left, and I really don't wanna waste that either. So I might eat that, but I'm also not in the mood for either of those things. So I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do yet. I'll keep you guys updated, but as for right now, I'm gonna see if this game works, and I will talk to you later. So the game ended up not working, and I'm really frustrated about it, so I hope that GameStop and Vintage Stock will take the game back because I spent like 30 something dollars on both the game and the hard drive, and I don't wanna keep it if I can't even use it, cause I'd be dumb. I did decide for dinner I was going to make bang bang cauliflower, which I'm assuming is supposed to be like bang bang chicken, but I wanted to show you guys Bowser eating cauliflower because I'm pretty sure it's the most hilarious thing ever. He is so loud when he chews it. Here's a big piece. <laughs> Currently I am in the mood of chopping up this cauliflower, making it into bite sized pieces, and then I will put it in eggs and panko and bake it and make the bang bang sauce. And that's what I have going on right now. I might go through my clothes tonight too and decide which ones I want to get rid of. Kind of want to go through a store shopping tomorrow. Fun times. Alrighty guys, this is the Bang Bang Cauliflower and I think it turned out pretty freaking awesome. I've been kind of testing it in the oven as it's been cooking and I think it's going to be pretty great and the best thing is it's super low in calories because it's a vegetable. I mean, come on, you can't get any better than this. I'm gonna eat dinner and probably watch some TV. So I will probably check back in with you guys sometime before bed. But if not, I'll see you guys tomorrow. After I get done with my coffee, I'm going to put my water bottle up, go try on all those jeans, get ready to go and start the day. Ian will be over at some time. I'm not really sure when. I'm not really sure what we'll do. Probably just do regular everyday stuff. It is actually kind of nice today. It's like going to be a high of 48, which is nice for right now because it's been in the low teens and negatives here recently. So pretty excited about that. I went outside to let Bowser out and I was like, oh my God, it's like warm out here. I could wear like shorts. No, not really. I'm not going to wear shorts, but I am going to uh, enjoy this day, I'm sure, because of all the errands I have to do. So that is all for now. I don't know if I'll take you guys shopping with me. I kind of think it would be fun to take you on my thrift store experience, but I don't want to look like a freak either carry my camera around in the store. I will talk to you guys later. You more than likely will see me before I leave for the day. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it's taken me absolutely forever to get ready to go and do anything today because I have not been motivated for the life of me. I got on the phone with my brother for almost an hour and we just talked and everything and then I finished up my closet and now I'm finally ready and I am going to go and do the things that I need to do today and that's all I have for right now. 
Hey guys, so Ian's over. He actually just went to go get food since today is a fasting day for me and I'm getting ready to go take a shower for the evening. Um, the shopping trip did not go very well. I didn't come up with anything. I was able to return my game in the hard drive though, so that's a good thing. But I didn't find any clothes, which kind of sucked since I'm donating these four bags. After he got here, um, we watched Pitch Perfect. He hadn't seen it before, so that was kind of our deal. Um, we have a hat now and we put movies in it and he draws the movie and that's the movie we watch. We did put back Sweeney Todd because I wasn't in the mood, but I think that's going to be our new way to watch movies since he hasn't seen a lot and he has something he wants me to see and I have something I want him to see and this way we get to see whatever movie. I did eat popcorn today, um, but popcorn of course doesn't have that many calories and since we shared the bowl, I'm not really sure how many I had so I didn't even add it to my calorie log today. I just know that I did eat popcorn and right now I have a cheesecake in the oven so I am cooking that for tomorrow so that's why I need to hurry up and go take my shower so I will be done whenever it's done in the oven. I did lick the beaters, but who doesn't do that, you know? Try not to overthink that, of course. I mean, it's really not that big of a deal. It's all I've had to eat today. So I'm gonna go take a shower and probably in this vlog here for tonight, but talk to you guys tomorrow at some point. I'm just not really sure when since he'll be here and I still have yet to get over the fear of vlogging in front of him. So I will see you guys tomorrow at some point. Hey guys, so I didn't get a chance to vlog at all today. It was a pretty slow but busy day as well. Ian and I basically got up and went and got breakfast at this place called Ginger Sue's this morning. It was really good. I got this don't be crabby omelet and he got some oatmeal. Um, my meal came with some potatoes and a biscuit and it was freaking amazing. I was so full afterwards. And then we came home and we watched Jeremiah Johnson. I hadn't seen it before. It was really good and I really enjoyed it a lot. I'm glad he showed it to me. It's one of his favorite movies. And then for lunch, I made Mexican macaroni and cheese. It was so easy and so delicious. I will link the recipe down below, of course. It's actually a Weight Watchers recipe, so the calories were really low, which is amazing, I'm not gonna lie. And then after the game, we went over to my mom's house and she made fried chicken, potatoes, green beans, and I brought my cheesecake and we had that over there. So really that is all we did today. Um, it was a good day to just hang out and things like that. I enjoy spending time with him so much. So that is all that happened today. It was a neat day and I probably ate over my calories, I'm not gonna lie. That is where I'm going to end this week's vlog though. Thank you guys for watching, of course, as always, and I will see you guys on the next vlog. <laughs>